ministry we have clocked we have recorded documented close to a thousand newcomers to our church service just in the month of january just in the month of january into our physical location over a thousand newcomers without the online with online it exceeds even close to maybe 1350 or whatever online ekkatara pas now as as the shepherd over this mega ministry i can go home and say oh praise god god is sending people oh what, what? and and be very casual about it and just take it easy you know that's not the way to go if you want to live a victorious life when you you have to first recognize that it's the power of god doing it and you have to have some sort of reverential fear towards what the scripture calls the anointing of God. When you have reverential fear towards the power of God, what you respect, you attract. What you disrespect, depreciates and leaves your life. Maybe someone's watching me now and you're saying, Prophet, I don't know, for many years I've been praying, I'm not healed yet. It could be because you have no reverential fear towards God's power. Oh, but Prophet, how can you say that? I can say that easily because I have the microphone. Not you. But in all seriousness, let me say this. Have you spoken against the anointing? Have you spoken against the power of God? Can I tell you something? That is the sin of blasphemy. Jesus said, All sin, all manner of sin will be forgiven. But the sin against the Holy Spirit will never be forgiven. Blasphemy against the Holy Spirit. Let me give you an example. Jesus said, I cast out devils by the Spirit of God. The finger of God. That means Spirit of God. Someone looked at it and said, Jesus is casting out devils by the power of devils. That is blasphemy. You as a Christian, you would have done it unknowingly. No wonder you are sick and not healed. Because you have spoken against the very power that can heal you. Or a man of God or a woman of God that's carrying that power that can bless you. But tonight I pray there's hope and there's repentance for you. For if you did it ignorantly, you will receive pardon and mercy. Church family, listen to me. Tonight, in a brief moment, in about 10 minutes from now, I'm going to pray that all of you will experience the power of God. Be ready for it. Power is what causes change. 
you may not be sick oba rogi vela nathu athi but power is not just to heal namuth balayake ana suwa karana itarak neve power is to save a loved one balayake ana adarniya kenek bera ganna to deliver a loved one from an accident adarniya kenek anathurakin bera ganna that you are not aware of oba nodanna oy ekak gana to save you from harm and danger oba karadaren sa anathuren bera ganna to bring salvation into your life oba ge jeevithata galawima gena ennata power is for many reasons balaya boho sehetun desai where is this power kohida me balaya tiyenne second corinthians chapter 4 verse number 6 devani korinthi 4:6 just a couple of verses and then we are going to minister to more people let's go to verse 7 because of time velavani sa we have this treasure in earthen vessels apita me bahumika bahajana wala me vastuwa tibenawa that the excellency of the dunamis may be of god and not of us devyan mahansage dunamis kena vishishtatwa ape neme devyan mahansa rachi deya somebody watching me on different platforms mawa naramana kenek vidha madhyawase listen to this mekata ehun kan denna The reason why suddenly fear came over me. Ek varama makare baya dukama kati wenne hetu. The husband in me feared the prophet in me. Maatulena swam purusha maatulena divasivara kare baya una. It happened it happened for in my life for the very first time. Palam watar mage jeevithe kati une. And then I realized. Idas man therum gatta. The man in me the natural man in me. Maatulena swabhavika manushya started to acknowledge that the power of god was of god and not of me idin maatula in swabhavika manusha therunga do you understand this me thiyana balaya devyan mahansage misa mata aithi deyak i don't know whether they understood this why don't you take 30 seconds and talk to them about it right prophet kiwa de thamai swam purushek vidiyata baluwata passe abhyantara inna divasivara adya yam kisi vidiyaka gauravaniya bayadukamak athuna idin e gauravaniya bayadukamat ekka thamai me panavideya oba veta gena enne ada so suddenly i realized that the power was i am not the source of that power ek varamam therugata mama neme me bale mula asre kene ka i realized that the power is of god mama therungatta bale aithi devyan mahanse te kiya did you see the verse oba dakka de padaya the treasure the thesaurus the rich deposits of god devyan mahanse ge utum pohosat kama which is called the power of god eka kene devyan mahanse ge bale utum kama kiyala the the issue is this prashna mena mekai god in his wisdom has hidden power in an earthen vessel devyan mahasun mahasage pragna aven me baumika bhajanayak tula balaya sangawa tibenawa so watch this balana meka the mistake you make oba karana varadha tamai is you look at a human being oba manushyek deya balala and all you can see is the vessel oba ta penne bhajane vitarai which is made of clay e kene mati welin hadapa ekak but god has hidden dunamis inside it namu devyan mahase dunamis e tula sangawa tibenawa when you look at the mirror in the morning oba udasana kannadi baluwama <laughs> you don't see dunamis oh, but dunamis pe na you don't see dunamis oh, but dunamis da kin na dunamis is inside dunamis abhyantara the power of god in a born again christian is in the inside nawa to padana labu kitunu ege deva bale den abhyantare listen to me ahun kan denne mata do you know that if you're born again you have raising the dead power inside you oh, but danna doba nawa to padana labu kenek na marane nuttana wi me bale oba tula tibena wai kiya the bible says ekai bible e kiyanne but some of you i know you're thinking like this oba gen samahara me mitra ge man danna prophet you've got something bigger than us namut prophet apeta wada vishala Let me explain why you think like that. Obeh mitan ne ekela man pahadri karana. And it is true. Eka satya. And here's what God gave me that perhaps he hasn't given you. Samahala to obata nodunna deyak mara devyan wahansa dilatina me ekai. What God has given me is an office. Devyan wahansa mara dilatina yam thanathura. The office of a prophet. Divasivarayaku ge karyabara. An apostle. Apostle vare. And with those offices. E thanantara karyabara samaga. Responsibilities. Vaga ki mekka. Comes more grace. Tha wada wedi anugrahayak paminawa. So with more grace. Wedi anugrahayat ekka. The anointing is actually more mature than what you have aalepe obata thiyena aalepeta wada parivata ekak the wisdom is greater prajna vihelai it's not because i am greater than you mama obata wada utum nisa neme oh i am special than you natta obata wada ma vishesha nisa neme it's the same jesus that died for you and me oba wenuwen samavana nekama yesus vahanse miyage do you have a different holy spirit obata wena suddhaatmana vahanse kene kiyawanne do we read different bibles api wenas bible de kiyawanne some of us are going to the same church api gen samaru yanne ekama sabhavata what's the difference mokadda wenasa ena the difference is what god has called called me to venasa tamai devan wasa maaya gata khandawa ti benawa venasa called you to something different devan wasa obo khandawa ti ne venas deyak kudasa when god called moses to lead the children of israel in the promised land god gave him a rod devan wasa moses khandawa wam porondu desha senaka gen un wasa sarati ak dunna uta and empowered the rod e sarati e balagannwa the anointing on the rod aale pe mata tabuwa just because 
you don't have a rod obata sarati ak naha kiyala that doesn't mean you are powerless eken adahas wenna abata balaya naha kiyala you have this power inside your physical body obage bautika me sharira tula me balaya obata thibenawa watch this balanna meka listen to this secret bohoma ahun kanda me sahasata so what where else does god hide his power wenna kohida dewan wahanse balaya sangawanna he hides it inside an earthen vessel unwahanse ka sangawana me bhoomiye thiyena bhajanayak tula i have already given you part 5 and 6 of where god hides his dewan wahanse balaya sangawana kotas pahas hai denata madhi lever obata he hides it behind reverential fear unwahanse ka sangawana gauravaniya bayaduguma paspasa he hides it inside earthen vessel saha me baumika bhajanayak tula unwahanse balaya sangawana are you listening to this now ahun kanda nada meka dai so as a child of god deva daruwek vidiyata don't think you are powerless obata balaya naha kala hitanne pa so here is where the secret is menna mehe thama rahasa thibenne if you ever feel that your body has caught an infirmity obage sharira yam dubala kamak athuna kala hitunu you don't have to worry oba karadara wenna onna understand that there's power inside you oba abhyantare balaya thinawa kenaka therum ganna you have the word of god obata deva wachane thibenawa you can speak to your sickness obage rogeyata puluwang obata katha karanna you can speak to that lump e gediyata katha karanna puluwang you can place your hand on any ailing part of your body obage sharire rogi sthanata wada thaba ganna puluwang and command it to align ana karanna puluwa ekata hari yanna kiya because you are a child of god mokada oba deva daruwek nisa The dunamis power is inside you. Dunamis bale oba tulati bena. But if you're not a Christian, namo to bakitu ne. If you're not a born again child of God, oba nava to utpa dale bu devadaru ek nevei nam. Then you don't have dunamis. Eh nangwa to dunamis na ha? You have something else. Oba vena de aktive ne. You have ignorance. Oba tiyan nosal keli vanta. So I'm going to invite you to accept Christ tonight. Mama adrathi oba aradhana kona Christ vanta. Receive the Holy Spirit. Shuddha adhan vanta laba ganna. And receive the treasure that God will hide in your earthen vessel. Oba ge baum ek ba. So I hope you're listening to this. In four minutes, I hope to be done. Minute to half hour, I'm not going to be done. But I want you to look, look at me. Listen to me with intention. Boom! Let's go back to that verse. But we have this thesaurus in Greek. It's called thesaurus. Thesaurus, what is it in Greek? That means a collective treasure of the richest deposits of heaven. Where has God hidden this? Inside. Inside earthen vessels. Me baumi ka bahajane aktula. Look at this. Me ka dia balanna. This is a revelation you must have. Me ko bade thiben nona eli darawa. That you don't need any outside aid. O bade vena kisi bahira udawa kavashan hai. All the strength, the power, the wisdom, all of that is inside you. O bade avashya bale pradna av samade mo babbi antare thiben. That the excellency of the dunamis. E dunamis si utum kama. Dunamis means the power of dynamite. Me dunamis ke lagya ne e pupura ne sulu bale. The force that causes bullets to explode ekane paturan pupurawanna au balaya wage ka that is what dunamis is eka thamai dunamis kiyanne the enemy will not stand in front of you oba idire saturata hitagena inna ba when did a christian receive dunamis kawadda kithunekata dunamis labenne do you know the answer oba danna duttare the day they were baptized in the holy spirit e aya shuddha atma bautisma labu dawasa the bible says in the first chapter of the book of acts the eighth verse bible ekena kriya eke ate but you shall receive dunamis when the holy spirit is come upon you nubala kare shuddha ආත්මයන් වහන්සේ පැමිණි කල නොබලා දුනමිස් ලබන්න. So do you have the Holy Spirit? ඔබට ශුද්ධ ආත්මයන් වහන්සේ ඉන්නවද? Have you received the baptism with the evidence of other tongues? අන්‍ය භාෂාව සමග ඔබට ශුද්ධ ආත්ම බෞද්ධිස්මය ලබා තිබෙනවද? The child of God you already have dunamis. එහෙනම් දේව දරුවනි ඔබට තිබෙනවා dunamis. So those who have dunamis do not miss this. එහෙනම් dunamis තියෙන අය මේක අතහැර ගන්න එපා. Hallelujah. Dunamis, don't miss this. Dunamis මේක අතහැර ගන්න එපා. Are you learning anything? Yama ke kena ganna. Go back to that verse. I'm almost done. Apo padeta mu api. 2 Corinthians 4 verse number 7. We have the richest deposits of heaven inside us. Api tula swarge e posat vastu tempat kar dibenawa. That the hupobole The the excellency means hyperbole in Greek. E utum kela kiyana Greek bahasa wen hyperbole kiyana. It means the super eminence of power. E kiyana bale ita vishishtathama utum kama kiyana. The 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 furthest throw of God's power. Devan wahansage bale e kiyana dirghatama vistara wima. The excellency of his power. Un wahansage bale ita utum kama. The reason so here's what Paul is revealing. Meka e Paul thuma elidara karanna. The reason why God decided to hide the anointing inside us devan mahas unwahasage aale pepatulu sangawanna hetuwa and then give us a physical body ida pass apata sharirayak dila is so that you will always realize evito bahama vetama therun ganna that the power is not because you're a good guy 
బలే తీన రాపత్ కనెక్ట్ నిసా నెవే ఇట్స్ బికాజ్ ఆఫ్ గాడ్స్ విజ్డమ్ దేవన్ వాన్సకే ప్రజ్ఞా వనిసా సో దట్ యు విల్ ఆల్వేస్ అక్నాలెడ్జ్ ఎవిట ఒబ హమ్మ విటమ పిలి గన్నో దిస్ పవర్ ఇస్ ఆఫ్ గాడ్ మే బలే దేవన్ వాన్సట దిస్ ఇస్ వాట్ హ్యాపెన్ టు మీ లాస్ట్ సండే మే కై మటల గీరి దౌ ఐ గాట్ ఇన్టు ద వెహికల్ వాహనట నెగ్గ ఆఫ్టర్ సో మచ్ హడ్ హ్యాపెన్ గుడాక్ దేవ సుదునాడ పస్సే అండ్ ఐ రిసీవ్డ్ ద టెక్స్ట్ మట పన వీడియా కమ్మనా ఆర్ యు హంగ్రీ బడి హావ్ యు ఈటెన్ ఎనీథింగ్ మనర్ కే అవద సడెన్లీ ఐ రియలైజ్ ఒక పార్ట్ మన తేరుంగ ఐ యామ్ హై హస్బెండ్ మస్వా పుర్షే I have a husband. Oh, Swam Purusha. When lumps were dissolving, Gedi Devan Avastha, and demons were coming out. Ashutath ma pita vedi. I forgot that I was a husband. But Amato ka Swam Purusha ke nega. You understand this? Nega bharte na nega. You only focus on the treasure. Oh, but this vastu ke na itra avastha. You forget that you are a, you have a physical body. Oh, but baut ke sadhya ke na ke na Amato ka na. That you need to eat. Oh, but khanno na. You need to sleep. Nida khanno na. Listen to me. Aum kandhe na mata. You may be sick tonight. Oh, but rogi velai thi adar. Listen to me now. I am kind of matter that. You may be sickly in your body. Samato bagi sarire rogi bawa kati. Don't let that sickness distract you from the power. E bale no bawata baada bale ta baada karana idu denne pai rogi. If you have a wound on your body that's not getting healed. Suwa no wena thwala ekthina no bage sarire. Receive your healing now. Obage suwa laba ganna that. If there is an issue with your appendix. Obage me unduka putche prashna ek thinawana. Be healed now. Then suwa laba ganna. If it's kidney ailment ek vakugadu prashnayak nam you are watching me now and you are saying prophet I've, my father has kidney disease oba kena mage taantara thina vakugadu prashnayak prophet listen ahun kan denna i know sometimes pain can cause you to only think of the physical body samaharala ata vedana avani sabata bhautika sharire gena vitara hengena you need to not miss this ek athara ganna pa please don't miss this me athara ganna pa when somebody is sick kene rogi unama the tendency is they tend to focus only on the body ai tamange sharire gena vitara kavadane mukarana patang ganna but i want you to know namuta badana ganna if you are a christian oba kisunu ek nang rogi vela inne inside the very body that has pain e vedana avati ne sharire tulama god has hidden dunamis divan mahase dunamis sangavati bena i prophesy mama divoka is a night for many christians to get healed adar ratri boho kitunu an suela bana ratri if you are a child of god oba deva daru ek nam don't casually accept wrist pain nikamma me manikkatu vedana nikamma bara ganne pa don't say oh my mother had it ah mage ammadat mege tibbane my grandmother had it mage aachya madat mege tibbane don't say that him kiyanne pa if you're a child of god oba deva daru ek nam you put your hand on that wrist now e manikkatu oba dan atata pala you command the pain to go vedana avata ivat pen ana karana if you're elderly or young and you have bone pain arthritis oba vadi hiti nattan tarun hari asthi vedana arthritis thiyenawana kitunu anta man katha karana if you're a christian oba kitunu ek nam you have dunamis inside oba abbe antare dunamis thiyenawana so i'm talking to all the believers and it's a sam adheli vanta kuru makatha karana your hand now then obage atata ba ganna on any ailing part of your body obage sharire onama rogi sthane Whether it's a lump, gediak kena puluan. Listen, ahum kan denna. It could be a scar from childhood. The lama kani lati na khela lak phella mak kena puluan. It could be an operation that's still causing pain. Thamat vedana vati karna parana shalle karma ak kena puluan. It could be a tattoo that went wrong and that's infected now. Varadich phatcha kotpe ka deng asadine vilaati. Could be a bad addiction. Narak abbe kama ak kena puluan. Whatever it may be. E de mukakuna. If you are a child of God. Oba deva daru ek nam. I prophesy. say again many christians are going to experience the healing power of christ right now wherever they may boho kitno ne ay inna sthane ada christus vaanse ge sue bale adda kitna place your hand on that part e sthane obage atata ba ganna it could be your abdomen samaat obage udare wenna puluwa diverticulitis uh, the twisting of the intestines e badawal harima patlim wage dekna puluwa ulcers e wage ma am twala impaired hearing shravana baada loss of sight peni madukama bad order me duganda cutting pitavena gland issues e wagama granthi prashna excessive sweating me adhika dahariya damima it could be small it could be big but it's annoying whether it's small or big eka punchi deyak wenna pala loka deyak wenna pala eka hari karadare yak wenna deyak put your hands to the lord obage atho swana swamin mahanse ta heavenly father kiyana swarga eka piya i acknowledge what jesus has done for me jesus mahanse maawana en karapu de mam bara ganna the cross of calvary e kurusiye calvary edi i acknowledge his death unwahasage marane mam pili ganna was for my sin eka maage paape udesa i acknowledge his resurrection unwahasage nawata naiti mam pili ganna was to give me salvation e mata 
galavim edena pinisa i receive every gift of god devyan vahansake sama deemanawak malla baga the greatest gift the holy spirit shuddha utumma deemanawana shuddha atma vahansake i receive my healing mage suwe mama laba ganna i receive my health mage saukya malla baga ganna and i speak to the power that resides in me ma tula tibena balayata mama katha karanawa den in the name of jesus jesus vahansake na amen and i command every ailing part of my body to recover sharire sama rogi sthana ekata ma suwe laba nana karana i am a child of god mama deva daruwe my body is the temple of the holy spirit mage sharire shuddhaatmana vahansake maligawai i refuse to be sick mama rogi vima pratikshepa karana we refuse to be ailing api rogi vima pratikshepa karana we refuse to be weak api durwala vima pratikshepa karana in the name of jesus jesus vahansake na amen someone shout hallelujah hallelujah wherever you may be oba koi sitya let your ears hear your hallelujah oba ke kang walata hallelujah kena ka henna denna thank you father hallelujah Now if you're not a Christian then oba kithunek nevei na and you're watching us and you're from different background oba wenat pasubi ma kenek na api balanne hear the gospel menna subaran chahanna jesus came jesus vaanse aava he was given a physical body on vaanse da bautika sharirayak labuna he was not born through the normal means of man and woman coming together mano purusha asa stri ek vimena siduna swabhavika krame neme unwasu pata labu jesus is god jesus vaanse devyan vaanse his body was given to him by mary unwasu ke sharira unwasu labune maria gen his life came from above unwasu ke jeevane pemani helin his birth was unique unwasu ke upata itamatma suvishesha born of a virgin womb kanyavaka gen upata labuwa His message was unique. Unvahansa ke panavide ita suvishesha. His miracles were unique. Unvahansa ke has kam atishya ananya. His death was unique. Unvahansa ke marane suvishesha ananya ka. His mission was unique. Unvahansa ke mehe ita ananya uwe ka. Everything he said, he did. Unvahansa ke pu hamma dema unvahansa kala. Everything that was spoken of him he fulfilled. Unvahansa ke na katha karala kiyala tibuna dewal tunnathe ishta kala. He said I'm going to rise again in 3 days he did it. Unvahansa ke man dina tunaki navatha nagitana kala unvahansa ke kala. The Bible says during 40 days after his resurrection he ate and drank with his disciples. Bible ke na unvahansa ke navatha nagiti men dina hataliyak tis unvahansa golen samaga khawa bivai kiya. Acts chapter 1 says that with infallible proof Jesus proved his resurrection to many. Kriya eke kiyana devyan unvahansa oppu kala hage sadaka sahitave navatha nagiti oppu kala hage. In 1 Corinthians 15 over 500 brethren saw him at once. Palan korenti pahala wekena ek vita sahodaran 500 ta adhika sankhyawak unwahansa dakka bawa. Chapter 9 a skeptic who crucified who 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 persecuted the church became a believer through an encounter with Jesus. Kriya namani paritte de di saka karamin christiani senagata pida karapu kenek unwahansa wa piligatta harima laba. Many of the books of the Bible in fact let me be very specific Luke and the book of Acts was written by knowledgeable doctor luke sa kriyapata liwe itamatma ugat vaidyavare kisi someone's watching me and you think christianity is for fools understand that even doctors were following jesus itin kene kitana nan kitano gane agnyano kela vaidya rupa yesus mahansage goliyo ma sitiya in fact let me rephrase it doctors realized there was something here vaidyoru terungatta metana yamme dak tiyenawa beyond medical science vaidya vidyawa abhibhava ge deya i mean waiting someone watching me narabana kenekoda man aaradhana karana to take the first step in your walk with christ jesus maha samaga obage gamane palamu piyavara ganata don't delay it anymore eka thawa dorata pramada karanne pa jesus is lord jesus maha se swami maha if you're there watching me now oba maha narabana wanan den and you want to pray this simple prayer of salvation me galavi me sarala yaknyawa karanna awashyana and take that first step e palamani piyavara ganata in your journey with jesus oba jesus I want to invite you to do this. Mang obada aradhana karana meka karanna. Be healed in your body. Obage sharire suwe labanna. But receive something that's much more than healing. Namuth suwe ta wada utum wada loku deyak labaga. Call salvation. Eka apa kino galavima kiya. The Bible says in Acts chapter 4 verse number 12. Bible ekino kriya 4 12 ay. Under heaven there is no other name by which a man can be saved. Aas inata manushya kota galavima labi hake wena kissi naame ak nathi bawa. Other than the name of Jesus. Jesus maansa ke naame harnu kota. So I'm asking you to come to Christ. Eni sama bada aradhana karo krikkarno Christus vahanse vetarenna ta. So that this rich treasure can be hidden in your body. Evita me pohosat vastu obage sharire tula sangawanna puluwanna parade. So that you can experience what we have experienced. Evita api addaka pude obata taddakinna puluwanna parade. I'm inviting you to pray this. Mang obada aradhana karana me yaknyawa karana. Say heavenly father. Kiyana swargika piyanani. Make me your child. Mawa obage daruwek kala menawa. As I confess Jesus. Mawa Jesus vahanse wa prakasha karana athara. As lord of my heart. Mage hadawate swamin vahanse desa. I receive forgiveness of sin. Mama paapeta samawala ba gannawa healing for my body mage sharireta suwela ba gannawa deliverance from the devil e yakshya gen midimala ba gannawa 
I acknowledge that Jesus is risen from the dead. Jesus wants to marry me. No, Tanu ba mam pili ganu. I'm asking you to make me your child. Mangu ba asa ke nila na mau ba ke daru ek kar ganu kya? As you fill me with your spirit. Abu answer ke aat mein mau pur na karna. Help me to understand the scriptures. Mata liye bil the runga no pakar kar mena ba. From this day forward. Me davase patan. I follow you. Mangu ba answer manu ka mane karna. In Jesus name. Jesus wants ke naam hai. Amen. Amen.